What's up dank homies, Duracell D Battery here and welcome to Sage News. And after doing YouTube for about two years now, I've finally figured out how to perfect my audio. I know, don't I sound so clear right now? Don't I sound so crystal clear? And speaking of perfecting things, uh, I don't know if you've noticed, but I've changed the thumbnails and titles of a lot of my more recent videos because I'm going with a new style or form of how I handle my channel. Um, I've changed my profile icon because that old icon is really out of the date and changed the thumbnails and the titles so that they'll be more like, hey, this is something I want to click and watch. And I don't know, let me know in the comments of what you guys think of the recent changes that I've made to the channel. Also, I'm going to be animating a new intro really soon, so look forward to that. But those things are outside of what today's Sage News is about. What today's Sage News is about is the Valbun Deluxe skin. The Rebecca posted to the Warframes forums that the Valbun Citadel Deluxe skin pack will be released either today or tomorrow. Now, look at this Deluxe skin. This thing is absolutely beautiful. Look at it! look at it that thing looks amazing now if you notice on the chest there are these four pipe tube looking things those things actually move they go up and down and make steam come out they've turned valbun into a steam giant also if you see in his hand he has an axe skin now i'm not exactly sure if this applies to hammer type weapons or axe type weapons or heavy blade type weapons but i have reason to believe that this is going to be for hammers now don't get all depressed and sad because you're like oh no i don't use any hammer type weapons well when melee 3 point out you may end up using the fragor or the arca titron especially the fragor because of that 1.8 extra channeling damage that it has and the arca titron has that special passive for when you do ground attacks so i can really see hammers becoming more closer to the meta when melee 3.0 comes out but if this weapon isn't a hammer and it's only for axes or for heavy bladed weapons that's pretty fine too lastly in the news avabun will be getting a brand new passive with his rework and his deluxe skin that's right, Hatelius. all those years of complaining and complaining about avabun's garbage passive has finally paid off Let's just hope that the new passive isn't as bad as the current one. Wait, you don't know who Rahatelius is? What? Well, Rahatelius is a Warframe partner who I've watched for an extremely long time. I really love his videos. Uh, imagine the Lorax, but instead of speaking for the trees, he speaks for game balance and different Warframes that he believes need reworks and different concepts that he has. After watching his videos, you normally leave with more information on different things in the game as well as food for thought. So I really highly suggest you go over and check out his channel because I really think you will like it. That's all the news we have for today. And let me tell you, Warframe and everything has crashed about 17 times in the process of making this video. So I'm finally glad to have this thing done, but if you guys enjoyed today's video, go ahead and leave a like, and if you haven't subscribed yet and you want to become part of the Dankum family, then go ahead and do so, and I will see you guys later. Peace, and much Don't change, don't change, don't change, even though life ain't the same. Don't change, don't change, don't change, life gon' make it happen anyway. Don't change, don't change, don't change, even though life ain't the same. Don't change, don't change. Change, don't change.